I clearly can't report it to the Pakistani authorities because the top Pakistani authority is the one that raped me. Yeah. And so he said that he would contact, he would put me in contact with someone else at the embassy, which turned out to be another male. And he said that they could ensure that I got on a flight back home. And that's all they offered me. That's all they That my own government failed me. But I wasn't going to give up. I did not want to give up. And I certainly did not want to burden my mother, who was a widower. I did not want to burden my family because I had convinced them that the Pakistanis were taking care of me. And I was fine. And everything was going fine. I lied to my family because I did not want them to worry anymore. But I also did not have the voice back then, nine years ago, that I have now.